And here we go. Return of the Demon Lords once more, this time with a character interview with Mr. I, I, hello, I'm Keegan. Uh, what? Yes, Where am I? That is your name, isn't it? As far as I know. Where am I? Oh, here, there, yonder. Does it really matter? As long as they're alcohol. Hmm, yes. Uh, hmm. Well, loose lips. So, okay, here, have a beer. Ah, lovely. One moment. Ugh. This is a weird, weird thing. It, do I do this? Okay, that's weird. Yep, there you go. Drink up. Uh, okay, so what's happened? Oh, we're here to talk about you. Oh, my favorite subject. <laughs> so, tell me, there's going to be people listening and some people watching, so what I need you to do is tell me a little about you. So, start with, describe how you look, appear, because not everybody's oh. actually able to see you. Tan skin? I know I'm pretty toned, and the ladies love that. <laughs> Wear a kind of open hoodie thing. It has strands, no sleeves, and a hood. I got shorts on, and I always have my rags right around my wrists and hands. They keep me from breaking my hands when I punch. As well as other things. Either way. Broken hands I don't wear shoes, though. Good. That Shoes are not good things. They give you less freedom. Sandals? Sometimes? Sometimes. I mean, if I'm like in a really hot area, sand and crap, or even snow. Well, I don't want to set my feet in snow. Frostbite, man. Yeah, it gets a little cold. Especially where I was raised. Especially where I met everybody. Even after everybody. Well, we're not worrying about them right now. It's just the two of us here. And the it's kind of creepy, so. but there's beer. Okay. Yep. Uh, so, anything else? Anything else about the ma me? Well, you carry any weapons? You use armor? Anything like that? <laughs> no armor. Weapons? Anything I can get my hands on, or even just my fists. Uh, I sometimes grab a tinker of ale in bar fights. Chairs are a very good thing to have, especially when they have weapons. Just kind of break their arms with the, with the legs of the chair. Ah, uh, so you don't really use a specific weapon per se, just whatever you <laughs> have to get your hands on? I mean, if I get a weapon, I can technically use it. I can throw it. I mean, I've catched, I have catched daggers and arrows and threw them back. Interesting. How well did you work uh, at throwing it back, though? That's for a different story right there. <laughs> that's, that'll be for another time. Mm. Well then, let's see. We've got uh, that now. Tell me, tell me a little bit about yourself. What, 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 what do you do? How do you do things? How do I do things? And that's a little bit of a st story. Basically, you know, I'm guessing you know my brothers. I, you seem to know things. I'm Either aware. Way. I know many things. Well, my well, Zell, technically the oldest brother because we're all orphans dropped at a monastery. That's how things work. Yeah, brother, oldest brother Zell went to be a, went to be the best monk. Kikaru sucked at being a monk. He found some paladins to teach him. And then me, 15 years old, went to a bar. I saw this guy. He kicked so much ass, and I just kind of begged him until he told me until he taught me how to do everything. In which it also comes to, uh, I learned to be a drunken master. Still am not completely done with that. So you're not a and true master, you're just a drunken fighter? Monk? I'm thing. a drunken fighter, I'm a drunken monk, you can tell. Drunken say. brawler, there we go, that's the word I was looking for. Best explanation, I'm not a really good monk, but I'm a lot better at doing things when I'm drunk. And somehow I remember getting two tattoos, I have a left tattoo of a heart pouring ale my right hand has a fire but that thing i have a tattoo of like some kind of demon on my back 
I think it's a demon. I don't know what it is. All I know, it looks badass. I'm guessing you were drunk when you did that. My master got me drunk, and then when I woke up, he laughed at me. He laughed his ass off. So, yeah. Well, that's what happens when you get drunk. Sometimes you do things, and sometimes things are done to you. Yeah, it hurt like a motherfucker. Either way, um... Hey, you're not dead. True. I'm still learning to perfect the drunken fist, you can call it. I'm still learning how to do that thing where you breathe fire with alcohol. That's gonna be fun. That'll be a neat trick. Yeah. I've seen it done a few times. Although, generally I also hear somebody complain about that was a waste of alcohol. Sometimes. My master used to do it. It was fun to look at. Yeah? How was being on the receiving end of it? <laughs> uh, burn marks for days. Which got me out of all the teachings in the monastery, which is good. Which is good. I say I got burnt by some kind of torch. <laughs> yeah. A flaming torch of alcohol moving at high speed, I bet. They don't need to know that. Uh, yeah. And God. Boss, we went. My master brings me to so many bars. Many bar maidens looking for a good time, but there was just one girl. Oh, her beard was gorgeous. Dwarf? Yeah. They ought to show you a good time. Got a thing for dwarves, do you? Um, I got a thing for male, female, in between, out of the way. Any species, really, as long as they don't eat me afterwards. Hmm. Uh, yeah, it was fun. A lot of fun times. I bet. So, I've spoken with a few others. They seem to have some sort of unique abilities. Is your unique uh, ability drinking? Yes. I can drink more than you. I can drink. I have drinking more than an elephant, I think. I've drinking more than a lot of things. So, yeah, my ability is drinking and being a lot better at fighting when I'm drinking. Which is a bit thing... If he, because if I drink enough, I'll just pass out. So the trick is to drink enough that you get really good at what you do, but not drink enough that you pass out. Exactly. I have, My ale is extremely strong, and I can only drink about five of them until I pass out. Normal people, about, I think, three. Two. An elephant dr drank a lot more than me, though. That was fun. He's also a lot bigger than you. Yeah, I miss that elephant. He was... Uh, <laughs> you got to fight with him, to. so... Meh. I didn't mean to. Uh, well, don't piss him off. Uh, no, he's gone with the flying lizard people. Yeah, don't forget that those weren't lizard people. They were giant lizards with wings. That's as far as I'm going to figure out. Yeah, we'll leave it at that. Okay. Because that's, that's not quite accurate. I'd like to see you call it a lizard to its face, though. That, that would be kind of entertaining, I bet. Yeah. Hmm. Either way, um, anything else? Because I guess you're well, interviewing me. Well, let's see. Me. We've covered what you look like. Oh, a little never bit forget. about you. Oh, hmm. Brown hair, hazel eyes. That lovely stubble that the women crave. Normal woman. Normal woman. The party's not... The, this group I'm with, not normal. No? Whatsoever. <sighs> so it seems you like the normal, but you end up with the not normal. I don't know. I, I don't even remember why I'm here. Something about alcohol? Really? I'm mostly here now, either find alcohol or because my brother's here. So, in other words, you got drunk. Don't remember what you did, but you ended up with the group. Yeah, that covers it. Nicely done, genius. <laughs> it, ha it happened more than once, but ever since, like, I'm 25 now, I think. Well, I'll tell you this. There's a trick. You drink mm. enough to enjoy it, to feel the effects. You don't drink enough to lose your mind. 
That's a waste, though. That's why I said you enjoy it. But if you lose your mind, you have no idea what the hell you're doing. True. All right. Uh, yeah, I can't really argue with that. Yeah, especially when I start looking at your past. Yeah, you really need to throttle it back a little bit. Still enjoy it. Still do all that. But this getting blind drunk and ending up in a place you shouldn't be and then waking up the next day and then having to run out the door or window. Oh, in this case, you had to make a hole through the window. I know, right? One day we meet this bard that I, that I, not, I, that I pass out for how many days. My brother's gone, and now this bard's hooking up my other brother. I don't even know where I am. See, that's the trick. Don't get yourself passed out drunk. Uh, so less than five. Okay. Keep it to about three or four. Four at the four. most. Five? Well, that's where you go thud. Face first into the ground. Uh well, six is about when I go face first. Five I can handle, but I'm like very, very tipsy by that time. <laughs> I wouldn't call that tipsy. That's not tipsy. I've been worse. Let me see, what was the term I heard one guy put it? Smashed, I believe. That sounds like a kale thing. Uh, no, it wasn't him. It was another guy. I think it was All a right. dwarf I heard it from. Mostly dwarfs, too. Dwarfs are fun people. Oh, yeah, he didn't remember anything, and he woke up three days later. <laughs> uh, and he still had a hangover uh, even then. I don't get hangovers. That's a good thing about me. Probably as because I wake never up, stop drinking. True. As soon as I wake up, I'm right as rain, and I continue drinking as I, as I was. There are some benefits to that. Yeah. Hmm. Well then, hmm, I think we've covered most of this. Hmm, let me think. What you look like, what you are, what you yes. do. A handsome drunken master, yes. You ain't a master yet, boy. That's true. I got like a few more years on me. You, you, you got a little ways to go yet. Yeah. Let me see. I mean, I've been doing for ten years. I should be somewhere uh, up up there. Yeah, you still got more to go. Uh, still got a ways to go. Oh, that's what I forgot to ask. How do you like spinning? Like going uh, around in circles? Last time I did, the whole entire room was covered in some green kind of crap. Don't know what happened. Ah. So it was an interesting experience for you? Confusing, very. Oh. Well, you best finish that beer, otherwise you might loot. You might spill it. All right, one moment. Uh, okay, I'm good. What? Okay, and around and around you go. Spin like a top, oh, and off you go. Nope. Yep. There we go, and swoop. He'll get there eventually. But, well, that was Keegan. Uh, he'll be spinning for a little bit. He'll be fine. That's why I hadn't finished the beer, otherwise he'd spill it. It'd be a waste of a beer. Oh, well. Well, I'll see y'all next time for the next person in line. <laughs>